Hi, I'm Nora Walsh. I'm the Director of Public Relations for the Pierre Atash Hotel. And tonight we're at our Tiki Social. It's our second annual um, celebration of Social Media Day. So if you blog, post, or tweet about the event, you can bring it in and get free cocktails. From, we have guest mixologists and guest bartender tonight. What struck me as really interesting was when I saw that Social Media Day was being celebrated at uh, an old world hotel like the Pierre, I'm going, wow, they're really embracing the new stuff. So tell me, how did that happen? Well, um, I have a background in social media, so when I joined the hotel last April, it was something that I really wanted to bring to the hotel. And We've had a renovation, and we have a new bar and a new restaurant. We have new rooms, and you know our bar is it's great for any age. So it really was bringing a whole new clientele into the bar and into the restaurant, and it's a new way to connect to you know a younger generation, a younger demographic, and they're online, they're in the social media space, they're all on Facebook, and it was a way for us to really connect with that new customer. So and it's really been working, and people love engaging with us on our Facebook page and through Twitter, checking in on Foursquare. We just had um, a guest, her name was Stephanie Pojdani, and she was coming from Hawaii, and she shared with us that she was coming here for the first time to New York ever, and they were staying at the pier, and it gave me a chance to engage with her, and we had conversations over Facebook, and when she came, I made her a little welcome package. It's a new way to engage with your guests and to meet them and make sure that they're satisfied, and another touch point for your, for your, um, for your guests to make sure that they have a forum that they can share their thoughts and opinions, experiences. So we're here with Blaine Ashley from CitySip.com. And, and Blaine, tell me, what have you, you've partnered up with the Pierre Hotel to do quite a, quite a great event. Tell me what's going on. Right, well, it's Social Media Day, as you all know, and we decided to collaborate with the Pierre Hotel to host the party for tonight, and it's a tiki social. And the cocktails are being brought to us tonight by um, Oxley Gin and Corzo Tequila. And we brought in two celebrity bartenders, Tobin Ellis from Las Vegas Bar Magic, which is a consulting company, and he does lots of celebrity appearances, and Charles Hardwick, who's um, in New York, and he's a very well-known consultant in the city. So we brought the music. Our DJ set, they're a duo. It's uh, Primativa is their name, and it's Jack Fetterman and Gina Hayes, and they go around the city spinning parties with cheeky themes. They work at cheeky bars. Tell me a little bit about City Sip. So CitySip.com is an online publication about all things cocktail culture related. We're a daily. Um, every Monday we cover events. Tuesdays and Thursdays we do top fives. We call them Sippin' Five. So top five hotel bars, top five pool bars, top five happy hours, anything and everything. Wednesdays we do recipe Wednesdays for readers to take and whip up their own cocktails at home. And on Fridays we have guest editor Fridays. I'm Adam Mirabella. I'm the global director of digital marketing for Nokia and I oversee social media aspects of Nokia's business. So I came tonight to see what was going on at the Pierre Hotel. You know, I thought this is a nice way to do something in the physical incarnation of what we do online all the time in social media, which is talk with people, get to know people, and spend a little time doing something you normally wouldn't do. And what do you think of the concept of, of having a, a day for social media, social media day? I think it's good because, you know, social media is so important right now to people in their personal lives. Of course, they connect with their friends and their family. But then also brands are trying to figure out how to connect more with consumers through social media. So I like this idea of bringing awareness around social media and letting people know that it's a way to connect with things that they love in their life. I'm not sure it necessarily needs its own special day, but it's always fun to have a special day. It's a good excuse to have a party.